Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel Vertex Manoj Roy. Today we are doing explanation of exercise 7.4, not the exercise. So in this exercise, in this video, you will understand how to form the equation of a straight line. Normally, when we have a straight line with the coordinate C and B, which formula we use normally? We use y equals to mx plus c. Remember, this formula y equals to mx plus c is normally used in syllabus D mathematics, where m is a gradient and c is a y-intercept. In this equation, we normally find the gradient first, then find the y-intercept, c, and then we use m and c and put in the equation and get the answer. But in at mass, we don't use this equation normally. We use this equation y equals to y1, sorry, y minus y1 equals to m, x minus x1. This equation is very important in admins to use what we have, like how we use where m is the gradient and y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1 is the gradient formula. I would like to give one example for this, uh, like how to use this equation in exercise 7.4. For example, we have two coordinates a and b, 2, 1, and 6, 9. Step number one, just we need to find the gradient with the normal method, that's y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. And when we substitute the value, the result is coming, 8 upon 4 is 2. When we know the gradient, when the gradient is given or we find the gradient, after the gradient, the step number two is this, using this gradient and any one of the coordinate, you can use 2, 1 or 6, 9 is up to you. This coordinate and one gradient, this gradient, you have to put the value in this equation. Just without finding the y intercept, without finding the c, you can get the equation directly. Like how? y1 and x1, 2, 1, we can substitute. y minus y1 means y minus 1 is equals to, gradient is 2, 2, x minus 2. After substituting the value of gradient and one coordinate, when we assemble the equation, after substitute, like making y the subject, the equation will be y equals to 2x minus 3. So this is the way we can find the equation of a straight line in additional mass only. Normally in mass, we cannot use this equation. We have to use y equals to m x plus c in syllabus t mathematics. Like in this video, I'm just explaining how to work like uh, this exercise 7.4, how we can use this equation by using 7.1 uh, explanation, 7.2 and 7.3, all together three exercise in this formula, how to form an equation of a straight line. You can solve some of the questions, not all, maybe some are very difficult. So for that purpose, I have to make one more video about exercise 7.4 to just only the solution of these questions one till 10. If you think this video is useful for you, please like my video, subscribe my channel and share with your friends, especially the juniors who have the problem in coordinate geometry in at, at mass. Thank you so much and have a nice day.